On the last vlog, I reached my final destination, but kept y'all hanging. Ah! morning African superstar family it's me I'm here in my secret location I promise I will reveal it today <laughs> I will reveal it today but hey you guys like vlogs you guys like entertainment you like a little bit of suspense so I'm just giving the people what they want huh I'm just giving people what they want yeah so today we have a couple things on our agenda um, I took a very extremely modest hotel here in the location where I am <laughs> big shout out to some of you guys uh, I saw some of your guesses actually the correct location is li listed in the comments of my previous vlog but I just haven't alluded to it yet but you will definitely know uh, by the end of this vlog um, so you know I think that's something that's always really shocking to people is how I go I mean I literally go for like the cheapest room I can possibly find if it's clean if it's safe you know basic amenities i don't need all the bells and whistles um you know a little unknown fact about your african superstar i haven't owned a tv in over 20 years so the latest flat screen i don't care netflix i don't i don't watch it um so when i'm in my room i don't even care <laughs> i have a room that's um 130 ghana cds currently and i'm actually looking to move to a hotel that's a hundred Ghana CDs, huh? What? Cheat, say cheat. Yeah, that's the key a lot of times to traveling is being frugal. You know, it's not necessary for you always to be spending a whole lot of money. Now you can take luxury vacations and stuff like that, but I've been able to see the world because I've been able to kind of reduce the cost of my lodging. So I'm here, I'm actually gonna have breakfast. I just poured my tea. Y'all saw me with the struggle life with the tea bag. What? <laughs> so I'm waiting on them to provide me. Breakfast comes with the room here. Huh? What? Nice. Yes. So what's up, uh, what's up African Superstar family? Hello. Have you yet subscribed to the channel? Have you been to the AfricanSuperstar.com? What about some cash apps today? What about some PayPal's today, huh? Where is the family at? Yeah, yeah. Now I do wanna also let you know that I got the mixed version of UK to Ghana back yesterday from the studio. Now I don't know when it's gonna drop because I'm trying to coordinate um, shooting the music video. Thank you so much. My breakfast just arrived guys, here it is. Mmm, egg, bread, and those beans. You know, them, them beans from the UK. I've never been too big on them beans. I, I never really got into it. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's the update. The The latest track just came out. UK to Ghana. I just got the mixed version yesterday. And um, you know, but I'm trying to coordinate with Tarzan how we gonna do this music video. And I'm actually, I have the shooting date for my new, my next music video, which is Come Chill With Me. We're shooting that in a couple weeks. So big shout outs to ODNAP Studios. It's going down. It's going down. Let's eat, guys.
The breakfast was not all that, but I mean, what can you expect? You know, <laughs> the tea was good. <laughs> I just I can't get with the beans guys I just don't like them for those of you who know in America this is part of the British breakfast is the beans like the English breakfast and I just never I never really kind of went to it so guys it's now 12 o'clock like a few minutes after 12 and I'm on my way to find my even cheaper accommodation <laughs> so we, we hope that um, it's decent if not I can always return back here I'm sure no problem so yeah so we're gonna go ahead and check out now so I'm in my chariot guys and um, the place I'm going is not far from the current place so we, we, we're gonna hope for the best I don't know what to expect <laughs> to expect um, but I guess this is kind of like a little adventure so you'll get to see the sights and sounds of the local neighborhoods Tired of all that crazy traffic, get out of sight of a crowd and see what's happening. Take a break. Well, guys, I must admit, for 95 CDs, this is pretty good. I even got a little flash screen for those of you guys that need the flash screen. A double bed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so that's really good. So I booked this place actually for the remainder of my stay here. I'm only going to be in town limited time. Um, but, yeah, so now that we have secured our room, Yes, now we can head to the beach. So I'm really excited to see what this particular place has in store regarding the beaches like I've been talking about. That's all I, I've heard so far about this location is like, oh, the beaches are really beautiful. So we're getting ready to venture to a beach in this area. So excited, yeah. Guys, I finally made it to the beach. And I have to say, this beach is better than the beaches in Accra. <laughs> um, the water is more, you know, pretty, better color. Um, the beach has way less litter and stuff like that. Um, it's really nice, it's really quiet. I've been sitting here on this rock and enjoying the sun. It's a really nice afternoon. Um, so I'm going to check out a few other beaches while I'm here in town. 
so that I can compare and contrast, but I'm pretty impressed with this first speech. I'm pretty impressed. I'm pretty impressed. Um, and this is what I really needed to do. You know, to be honest, I have a lot on my mind as usual. Shout out to all the intellectuals out there. The struggle is real. You know, our mind is running at 100 miles per hour. Um, I'm always trying to figure out how to be more productive and be more succinct with the direction I'm taking in life because, you know, I've, I've missed out on so much valuable time. And a lot of you guys will say, oh, Gina, it's not missed time. You know, everything's working. God's time is the best. Whatever you want to say, okay? At the end of the day, time that is spent and gone and wasted is time that is spent and gone and wasted. Okay, and unlike you guys, I don't like to just hope and wish. I like to do things strategic. So the time that I didn't get to, that I wasn't doing, you know, I wasn't preparing myself for the life that I have now or the life that I wanted, it's wasted time in my opinion. Um, with that being said, I, I'm, I'm so much in an accelerated mind state right now because I do feel like I've missed a lot of time. So I feel like I need to be making sure all my decisions are as good as they possibly can be um also you know certain things in my personal life just trying to figure out how to get those things you know to align and how to flow um and so coming out here to the sea is something i love doing you know i tell you guys all the time living here in ghana is a luxury it's a luxury living on the continent is a luxury you know things i otherwise have to travel to do in the past and could maybe manage to do it once or twice a year, I have the availability to do it anytime I want, you know, such as come to the sea, you know. Um, going to the beach is a luxury for a lot of people in the West. <laughs> a lot of people. If you're not living on the East Coast, the West Coast, you know, um, you know, down, down South, some areas down South, you don't have access to beaches, which means to get to beaches, you have to travel, which means you have to spend money, okay? Um, we can come here in Ghana, go around the country and experience lots of beaches, warm weather. I mean, it's amazing. Palm trees, you know what I mean? It is a luxury. So, yeah, guys, I still haven't revealed, right? But my next destination I'm going to right after the beach, you guys will finally get the official location. Yes. I'm not going to do you like that on a second vlog. I did promise. I did promise. <laughs> so I'll definitely um, reveal that to you. So for now, um, you know, I'm, I'm just going to chill and that's going to be my afternoon. Okay guys, so if you have not figured it out by now, I mean, I've given a lot of hints. If you're even paying attention to the video, you probably saw some names and locations, you can figure it out. But just in case you didn't know, I am at the Takarati Mall, AKA Toddy for all my Ghana foe. Yes, so I'm right outside the Takarati Mall. Um, this may look familiar because there's lots of malls in their crowd with like the same kind of architecture. I believe probably the same producer has, um, you know, or the same developer rather, has created this mall, just like I understand there's a Kumasi mall, but there are several of them in um, Accra, you have Accra, you have Achimoda, you have uh, West Hills, and they all have the same. So I've come to the Takarati Mall. Um, there's also a popular sign that's here um, that you won't want to miss. So if you guys have ever been to a cry, you know there's a big I love a cross sign. Well, there's a I love Toddy sign right here outside of the Takarati Mall. So Toddy is the local name for Takarati. This is the home of the Fantis. They speak the Fanti language here. Um, so yes, I know a little bit about the Fantis, obviously Fifi. 
was a fancy <laughs> is a fancy <laughs> um yes so i've been enjoying my visit so far in takarati i've now been here two solid days i actually came to the mall last night and met a friend we got a little bite to eat this is i'll probably come here every day and get something to eat as i spend my time at the beach so yes the cat is out the bag. Big shout out to the African Superstar family. A lot of you guys could guess it. I suppose some of you that have been to Takarati or you recognize some of the sights and sounds. So good for you on the last vlog. Yeah. So I will be here for a few more days. Um, you can reach out if you want to and see perhaps if we can link up. I've already a few of my YouTube, you know, Facebook and whatnot uh, that know that I'm here have already.